So what you're currently watching is footage of my live stream where we were playing Among Us with viewers and I ended up getting imposter over and over and over again. And yeah, it got so bad. Due to this being a playing with viewers stream, the commentary on it wasn't that really good. So I decided to just do a voiceover on this. I'm just gonna tell you what I all did to get this four times win streak as an imposter so you can do it too. So okay, I was just venting around a little bit, trying to blow up the reactor as well though. But then I see Cyan is standing in the room perfectly alone. So I kill him. But my teammate walks in and reports it. Uh, so we go into the first meeting. Now, nothing really happens in this first meeting besides SG Minor being a little bit suspicious of me. But for the rest, we just end up designing we're going to do a skip. So after that meeting, I jumped into the event, made my way up to Reactor where I saw Burps was running around. And he was suspiciously running away from me like he knew I was the imposter without any proof. Turns out he was actually stream sniping. So we ended up banning him after this round. But I didn't get the kill on him. A few other people ran in. In, so I made my way out of there. After that I just end up running around the map a little bit, fencing around, until we all get into this really really small space where my teammates made a very very rookie mistake. He just kills the stream sniper right in front of them. So yeah, to keep a long story short, pretty much he tries to defend himself, tries to blame somebody else, but everyone agrees it's him. So we kick him off. So after that, my teammate sabotages the reactor and me and Cassie are the only ones going up to the reactor and we have little to no time left to actually save it. I'm like saying there, can I win? by just blowing up the reactor. And turns out, yes I can! So that's a pretty first good GG. And by the way, ladies and gentlemen, just to prove to you all that I actually did get imposter five times in a row, I'm leaving all the intermediate pieces in here so you can all see that this isn't edited up. By the way, while we're here, don't forget to smack that like button. Let's get 25 likes and we'll do this again in Discord with better commentary and while you're down there, why not subscribe? Okay, let's go into game two. So I started the second round off with faking a few tasks to not look suspicious at all. After that I see I can sabotage something so I decide let's sabotage the reactor and make my way over there. Maybe we can get a kill. Maybe I can make myself look less suspicious. At reactor I see there's not really a way to kill anyone over there so I just decide let's get the hell out of there and see what else we can sabotage. Okay so I can see let's sabotage O2. Let's make my way up to the uh, north O2. I see not nobody really there so I just fix the thing in case somebody was suspecting me but I see my teammate coming up to brown at admin and my teammate just kills him. So I decide, okay, let's report it. Let's get myself in a really strong position so they don't suspect me. First meeting, nothing really interesting happens. Uh, besides Spooky just fighting for himself. That's actually the most interesting thing that happened over there. So we just, just decide to do escape. After the meeting, I fake a few more tasks and sabotage the comms, but there isn't really an opportunity to kill anyone over there, so I make my way up to the reactor and start fending around a little bit until I see in the cafeteria the perfect opportunity to kill Yellow, which I instantly take. At that moment I kill him, at the moment I kill him, I get out of there as soon as possible, uh, make my way back up to the reactor to look to look as little suspicious as possible. Somebody reports in the body and we go into the second meeting. In the second meeting, we talk and discuss a little bit about who it could be, uh, but Spooky starts acting really, really suspicious at once, so me and my imposter friend both jump on that and try to accuse him, which works out in the end because we eventually just vote him off. Turns out he wasn't an imposter, a little bit of a shame for the crewmates though. So in the last bit of this round, I just sabotage a little bit more, run around a little bit more, until I see Orange is standing alone in a room and it just stayed a kill and turns out that was all we needed to do to win. So GG second round. Let's go into round three. Okay, so for round three I was thinking there is absolutely no way I'm gonna get imposter again. What happens? I get freaking imposter again. Like legit, I'm like cursed or something with being the perfect imposter. So I start doing the same stuff again as I did last round, go put a few people to Mad Bay to try to get myself a little bit of an alibi. Then I go check the door locks a little bit just to not look suspicious at all. But then I make a little mistake, me and Brown go into decom and I kill him and accidentally self-report on him. But then one of the most luckiest things happens in the entirety of the stream, my teammate starts freaking out and starts defending himself like crazy. So everyone catches on to him that he's the imposter. So we all vote him off the island 
Island. Then he rages a little bit though, but it put me in a safe position again. After that meeting, I just uh, decided, okay, let's sabotage the reactor again. And I went on top together with SG Minor, but it turned out nobody else was going for the reactor. Only Cassie was just waiting there apparently. So 10 seconds before reactor meltdown, I just make my way down there just in case somebody else was going up there, but nobody else went. So I won by blowing up the reactor, not once, but twice, legitimately. I'm too good at being an imposter too. You should never trust me in Among Us, to be honest. By the way, ladies and gentlemen, this was recorded live over at twitch.tv slash host789. So if you want to come join us in and play some Among Us with us, uh, go follow the Twitch and as well join the Discord because we also play a lot of Among Us in there. But let's go into round four. So round four, you're probably thinking there is no way he's going to get imposter again. Guess what? I got imposter again. So I decide let's do the same stuff again that we did the last few rounds. It worked and it should work now again. Uh, but to get myself a little bit more of an alibi, because people were getting a little bit suspicious of me, I go and follow Commander into Mad Bay, stay a little bit with him, and then Lock strikes again. Me and Commander go up uh, in DCOM, and we find the body over there just before Reaction Meltdown. So I could have gotten an easy win, but hey, I got a strong alibi this time. So I decide let's do the same stuff again that we did the last few rounds. It worked and it should work now again. Uh, but to get myself a little bit more of an alibi, because people were getting a little bit suspicious of me, I go and follow Commander into Mad Bay, stay a little bit with him, and then Lock strikes again. Me and Commander go up uh, in DCOM, and we find the body over there just before Reaction Meltdown. So I could have gotten an easy win, but hey, I got a strong alibi this time. So in the last few bits of the uh, fourth round, I tried to uh, fake a few more tasks and yeah, but then a reactor meltdown goes on. So everyone rushes up to there. So we stop the reactor from blowing up. So I go into the lab next to it though. But Commander, you know, the one who saved me in the first round uh, comes into that room and I see the perfect opportunity to kill him. So I kill him as thanks for saving me in the last round. Turns out that was all I have to do again to win. <laughs> So now we're entering the absolute last round of me doing extremely well as an imposter because I think if you were in a game with me and I've gotten imposter four times in a row, would you trust me? I don't think you would, nor did anyone in the game. So uh, yeah, we call an emergency meeting first thing and the first thing they all decide to do is to just kick me out. And turns out good for them because I was the imposter again. To be honest though, I have absolutely no idea how did I get imposter five times in a row. But hey, if you know it, let me know it down in the comments down below. And let me also know what are the chances of getting this five times in a row. But yeah, pretty much after that, my teammate tries to build in a victory. But in the end, it doesn't work out. So yeah. But ladies and gentlemen, I hope you all enjoyed watching this Among Us video. Click on the right, click on the right if you want to subscribe. Click on the left if you want to see more videos. But ladies and gentlemen, I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget, have a great day and goodbye. And don't forget to smack that like button. See you in the next one.